Is all that nostalgia stored in your attic a potential treasure trove? Maybe you've seen the rumors online about old toys and movies earning you some serious cash someday. Is it true? Stephanie Whitfield verifies. Remember when Beanie Babies were all the rage? A lot of people believed one day they'd cash in on their beloved collections. Well, that day still hasn't come. Now the same rumor is going around for Disney VHS tapes. Remember those? That's why Angela Krog emailed our Verify team saying, I did read a while back that Disney VHS movies still in their original VHS box were worth a pretty penny. Got any news on this? To verify this question, we went to one of the very few businesses that still sell videotapes, Half Price Books. Well, we'll probably have a couple hundred at a time available for the public to look at. And we Manager out. Nicole Malik says, no, you're probably not going to cash in on your Disney classics. Disney specifically, we probably do see at least a couple times a week. And people are very surprised that we can only give a little bit here and there for them because we do only sell them for about a dollar piece. So where'd the false information come from? Blogs started the rumors a few years ago because Black Diamond Edition classics are listed on eBay for two, three, even $10,000 a pop. But just because something's listed at a certain price doesn't mean anyone will actually buy it. And if you look closely, page after page of auctions have zero bids. So we can verify this claim is false. The old tapes in your attic are not going to help you retire early. Unfortunately, their value is purely sentimental. With your Verify, I'm Stephanie Whitfield. Wow. All right, if you see something you want us to look into, email verify at khu.com. You can also reach out to us on Facebook and Twitter. That's a bummer, man. No. That's a bummer. Oh. I know because my whole family would be able to retire with the mm -hmm. amount of baby babies that my mother and my <laughs> sister have. And we have like uh, containers of them. And of course, you had to put the little tag protector on it because yep. if the tag was damaged, then the bear, like the Princess Di <laughs> bear or whatever, was worthless at that point. So we've got hundreds of dollars, if not thousands. Are you going to do anything with them? Babies. Heck no, I don't want them. When my grandmother passed away, we got about 14 huge plastic bins. She had stockpiled all these beanie babies. They weren't worth even what she paid yeah, for them. Exactly. Oh, man. Oh, I remember when they were all the rage. I mean, mm -hmm. the lines I would stretch down through the malls. Anyways. Yeah.